Hi, welcome to Code Sapi. Today we are going to see the demo of blood bank management system by using main key technologies. Go to Visual Studio Code and I import your project folder here. Go to File, Open Folder and import your project folder. I have already imported the blood donation app. The three folders are there backend, client, and DB. The backend folder is a server folder, and the client folder is a front end folder. These are all the source code for this app. In this client folder, the source codes are there in the SRC folder, SRC component. And these are all the these are all the source code. Then go to terminal, new terminal. Give your path ready backend. In the backend folder, should run should run in terminal by npm star. The client folder should run in the terminal by giving npm run dev. The front end folder is running in localhost 5173. The back end folder is running in server is running on a HTTP localhost 4000. Database connection is ready. Go to localhost 5173 in your uh, local browser, web browser. Then these are all the modules of the blood bank management system. <coughs> Here user login and ask per login and admin and the free of guest. Guest is there is no login for guest. Uh, he can view the blood bank management by clicking on the simply visiting Simply visiting and check the donation and uh, blood bank details. First, go to user login module. Then, if you have a new user, click onto the register now button. Here, you can give your name, email ID, password, and mobile address and priorities. Click onto the sign up button. So, you are registered successfully. I have already created the user at gmail.com. The password is test at Android. Click on to the login button. If you have forgot your password, means click on to the forget password button. Here you can reset your password by giving your email ID, your uh, security question one and two like that. Um, pet animal name, your best friend. Then enter your password. Back to user login. I have already created a user at gmail.com. Password is test at 100. Click on to the login button. Login successful. Then these are the user home modules. In this user home modules, there's a find all donor and ask for blood bank. Here you can, <coughs> in this file all donor, you can find the blood donation donors details and their contact number and uh, details email details also you can contact them directly and ask for a blood donation in this hospital blood bank you can see the hospital blood banks available whatever the blood groups are available in the particular hospital site first go to find all donor here you can see the donor list like that the name, the email ID, and the age, and the donor address, and the don <laughs> donation blood group type, and the gender type. And uh, you can directly contact to the donor mobile number and ask for a blood donation. So I can go to hospital blood bank module. This hospital blood bank module, here you can see the hospital name the hospital address and the hospital city wherever 
the hospital contact number and these are all the blood status which is available from the hospital side uh, and the hospital email id back to user form then you can donate your blood group uh, if you want to donate your blood means click under the donate blood uh, module uh, give your name and your age and your address like that i am going to give the in peter mm, the age is only five uh, the city chennai the mobile number is give your mobile number and select the blood group uh, which is my blood group means uh, a positive and i am male and select enter click under the submit button your donation has successfully created then click onto the my donation module here you can view your donation type i have already donated to now i i was donated the name as a peter and the given details are shown here if you want to edit your details donation details click onto the edit button uh, you can edit your donation detail if you want to change the blood group means you can change your blood group or uh, your address or your contact name number anything and click on the submit button or uh, donation details updated successfully if you want to delete your donation means uh, click on the delete button you can delete your donation card <laughs> then back to your cell phone and the final model is my profile this my profile you can view your profile details your name email id mobile and address if you want to edit your uh, profile means click on to the edit profile button here you can edit your name your address and your mobile number you can do some button and edit as successful then log out and go to hospital module i have, if you are if you want to register uh, don't have login means click on the register now button here you can register a hospital register like a given hospital city and the hospital email id and the password for hospital and hospital mobile number and that hospital address and pin code click on the sign up button i have already created the hospital like uh, meat.gmail.com the password is test at 100 uh, t is a capital S. click on to the login button uh, i change my hospital at uh, meat like hospital at gmail.com i have already created and click on to the login button login successful then this is the hospital home site module here you can create your blood details and then update your blood details and your hospital profile first go to create blood details module here you can give your uh, hospital blood man status like you can update the blood status where which is available in your hospital at the current time give your hospital name like uh, follow on the hospital address your hospital city main city and your hospital mobile number like 0421 and the select the blood available in your hospital like if you are if your hospital available a positive blood is available means click on the drop down and click yes if uh, if the a negative blood is not available means click on to the a negative select no if the b, b positive blood group is available in your hospital click on to the b positive drop down yes like that you can update whatever which whatever the blood bank status is available in your hospital depend upon you click on to the submit button sorry
when you have created your hospital name and the blood is available in your particular hospital if you want to update it, the hospital location live means click on the geo map button here i can i will update my uh, update the hospital location and click on the show map button the hospital exact location is showing here if you want to edit the blood status in your hospital means click on the edit button here you can edit your blood bank status like a a positive now now the blood is available means click on the yes change to yes and uh, b negative um, blood group is available means click on the yes button uh, updated successfully then these are all the blood groups which is available and not available in my hospital details if you want to delete the hospital blood bank details means click on the delete button you can delete your blood available status in your hospital then go to home the update blood details is the same as now we see then the third module is hospital profile module in this hospital profile module you can view your hospital details and you can edit your hospital profile and here you can edit your password like you change your password if i am i am already as, as a tested under now i am going to change the password like the test at 123 then click on to the update button here i can update my password then go to logout then the third module is admin module the admin module the password and uh, email id is the same like admin and gmail.com the password is test test click on to the login button login successful this admin home these are the two modules which is going to see the report of the donor side and hospital side if you click on to the donor report here are the donor reports which is the higher operator peter now uh, peter and the email id of the peter donor side and their age mobile number address like that etc and the hospital report you can see the uh, whatever the hospital have created for a blood bank donation blood bank status like that these are all the hospital uh, which is registered in this app and this this is the two modules on the admin side go to logo then the final module is guest side here there is no user id and password needed click on the guest yeah, just like a guest appearance if you want to search donor and set click on the search donor button here you can see the donor who are all um, donate their blood type if you want if you want to search by your donor, blood type means click go to the search button and you can give a positive means the a positive donors will show you filter and show you uh, if you want to search by nearby your address means click on to the you can see your nearby your address and you can contact them directly by um, showing their mobile number i have filtered a positive okay, i want b positive means b positive filter is by there you can search by b positive and you can view their address if we if i have a nearby address to my location is there means you can do my mobile number i can contact them directly you can search and find them the same the search blood bank module in this search blood bank module we can search by your nearby hospital in by your location like a chennai here all the chennai details are there like that you can search by nearby your locality and you can contact them directly by showing the mobile number and you can check what are the blood bank 
status is available in that particular hospital then go to exit then these are all the modules of the blood bank management system okay thank you for watching us have a nice day